कांग्रेस में विनेश फोगाट बजरंग पुनिया जो है वो शामिल होने वाले हैं जिस पल की आप सबको भी इंतजार थी कुछ ऐसे दो साथी हमारे जो आपके सामने बैठे हैं जिन्होंने बहुत कुछ जीता और इस देश का दिल जीत दिया ऐसे दो साथियों का हम स्वागत करने के लिए यहाँ इकट्ठे हुए हैं सबसे पहले मैं हरियाणा के प्रदेश अध्यक्ष श्री उदय भान जी से आग्रह करूंगा कि इनका वो स्वागत कहें दो शब्द आप कहें हमारे ऑल इंडिया कांग्रेस कमेटी के जनरल शक्ति ऑर्गेनाइजेशन आदरणीय श्री वेणुगोपाल जी हमारे हरियाणा प्रदेश के इंचार्ज जनरल शक्ति आदरणीय श्री दीपक बावरिया जी आदरणीय श्री पवन खेड़ा जी आज जो हमारी पार्टी में सम्मिलित होने जा रहे हैं हिंदुस्तान का गौरव जिन्होंने अंतर्राष्ट्रीय स्तर पर दुनिया में पूरा अपनी प्रतिभा का जो और इस देश की आम जनमानस का दिल जीतने का काम किया आदरणीय हमारी बेटी विनेश फोगाट श्री बजरंग पूनिया दोनों ने ओलंपिक में जिस तरह से अपनी प्रतिभा का प्रदर्शन किया पहले बजरंग जी ने और अब फिलहाल के जो अभी फ्रांस में हुए जिस तरह से विदेश हमारी बेटी ने दुनिया की जो सबसे बड़ी पहलवान को चित्त करने का काम किया उसने पूरे हिंदुस्तान की जनता का दिल जीतने का काम किया और हम सभी हरियाणा वासियों को तो बहुत बड़ा गौरव है कि हमारे हरियाणा से ऐसी हमारी बेटी ने जन्म लिया हमारी प्रतिभा भगवान जो हमारी देश के जो खेल के स्तर पर जो ऊंचा बढ़ाने का काम किया आज वो हमारी पार्टी में शामिल हो रही हैं अभी वो खेल के अखाड़े में थी अब राजनीति के अखाड़े में उतर रही हैं मैं उनका हरियाणा प्रदेश कांग्रेस कमेटी की तरफ से हार्दिक स्वागत करता हूँ अभिनंदन करता हूँ धन्यवाद अध्यक्ष जी माननीय के सी वेणुगोपाल जी हमारे महासचिव संगठन से आग्रह करूंगा कि एआईसीसी की तरफ से वो दो शब्द कहें धन्यवाद टुडे इज द बिग डे ऑफ इंडियन नेशनल कांग्रेस ए प्राउडफुल मूवमेंट फॉर ऑल ऑफ अस to make join Vinesh Pogat ji and Bajrang Punia ji inside the platform of Indian National Congress. Vinesh ji hailing a family from Rasalers. When she was nine years old, her father was shot dead in front of the house of a relative. Of Can you imagine that? When a girl child was nine years old, her own father shot dead by nearby the family premises. But. her conscious mind brought her here her braveness brought her here her courage brought her here become a three time olympian having completed in three different weight classes 48 kg in 2016 53 kg in 2020 and 50 kg in 2024 in 2024 she became the first indian woman wrestler to have reached final at the olympic games our we know most disappointed news india heard that point of time she had been disqualified in the same games she had also become the first international wrestler to defeat the then reigning olympic champion yusuzaki after the disqualification she announced retirement 
one of the very sad news again after her father's death mother second last sad news says by vinish ji that is not only for vinish ji for entire country the retirement from olympics field you know her journey completely her journey you know that the moment there she led along with the bajrang punia ji and other wrestlers they took up their cases of self respect decency in their field which is totally denied by the wrestlers association of india and their country stood with him her and these people we indian national congress i'm proudly say that rahul gandhi ji priyanka gandhi ji mallikarjuna kargye ji all senior leaders and all leaders of india alliance also stood with her stood with them for their genuine causes for fighting against the injustice which happened to them not only they stood for their field they fought for the kisan of this country you can witness that when kisan agitation happened they are there with the kisans they fought for agnivir when they are in great difficulties there this is the social commitment of this great players great resolutions that's why indian national congress is very proud to accept them in this party let's become leaders will come through moments these two people came through a biggest moment in this country now somebody is criticizing i saw that that these are all the conspiracy congress conspiracy so many athletes are in different different parties so many olympians are also in different parties is that also a part of conspiracy now we are very proud that i am again telling this big stalwarts of indian sports history let them moment they know that which party has to trust through their experience they completely know about that therefore they choose an indian national congress as their party this is what happened bajrang punia ji i don't want to introduce much because everybody know bajrang punia ji an indian freestyle wrestler who complete in the 65 kg weight category at the 2020 tokyo olympics punia won bronze medal the prominently advocated farmers cause every now he requested what was the request from him sir i am very much happy to say that our congress president and rahul gandhi was so very much happy by hearing the request he told i am the party to work for the farmers of this country actually it is a very very proudful moment for all of us he protested against the three farm laws and protested for agnivir scheme punia is the only indian wrestler to win four medals at the world wrestling championship he won a gold medal at the asian wrestling championship held in 2017 and 29 he also won gold medal in 2018 2022 commonwealth games and 2018 asian games he received arjuna award also the arjuna award the road we are very gap happy surprisingly i have to show one notice to you which vinish got today she resigned her job today itself after resigning 
She got a WhatsApp message from railway authorities. Shock cost notice. What was the reason? Yesterday, you people in their television media and newspapers printed their, their photo along with the Rahul Gandhi, the leader of opposition of this country. Is it a crime to stand with the leader of opposition of this country? They didn't join. They didn't talk to anybody. The railway is running behind rumors. They are, they are telling that there are news, there are reports that you are going to contest the election. Therefore, you have to. We cannot contest the election while you are an employee. Therefore, give a an explanation. They didn't told anything to anybody. You people know that. They only done a crime which they are mentioning. They met leader of opposition Rahul Gandhi. They are not leaving her. Are they not leaving her? What is they are thinking? The railway authorities? Are they want to penalize again? Enough is done. Now also you are not leaving the here so I think you are